I go by the international name of Damo. Never been a lame-o. Not it's the same-o. <laughs> that was for Bart. That was for Bart. Yo, then he said same-o. Come on, dog. You're not about to jack that, Willa. You're not jacking that. It's your boy, hey, that boy, Bari. It's your boy, that boy, you, Bari. This nigga said same-o. This nigga said same-o. Bro. Bro, bro, you're not gonna say your name to interrupt my name, right? This is Jay Willer the Podcast Killer, aka Podcast Poppy, aka the Pop Father. And guess what, man? This is Willow Wednesdays. You about to get some ghetto news from your relationship gurus. Oh, that that was kind of that was kind of on point. That was all right. It was it was it was a little there, but yo, can 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 we speak about your name, Dame? For real, like, can we do that? Like, what's bro. up? Talk to me. You don't like my name, bro? You're not international. Uh, no, no, actually, no, 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 no. I'm not gonna lie. You are international. Will you tell them when? Will you need no, to tell you, them? You you know you know you are international. I'm so international. Te- technically, his name makes sense. I've been trying oh, to tell man. y'all. Niggas love the oh, shit God. on me. Real, no, no, no. His, his I've, shared, I've shared the videos and the people rocking oh. to my shit in France, in Russia, in shout England, out, in London. Russia what are you talking England. about? I'm international. I'm international. Don't be hating on me. No, listen. Because you got a, uh, a gas station pill in your name. Oh. oh. <laughs> 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 oh, so that's where we going. Okay. <laughs> listen, <laughs> listen, listen. It was a long night, but, but and I way. had as some work to put in. Black Rhino. <laughs> listen, because I I I, I rum things. You understand? Think <laughs> rum. Okay. Respect that. Yeah. But what's good, man? Um, how was y'all week? And um, we're not gonna go off on tangents. We're just gonna say weeks. I dare you. <laughs> okay. Oh shit. So so let me start since we we started the whole thing differently. Um, right. my week was dope. Um, I had a lot of positive happen. Um, I made more money at work. Nice. So I'm I'm with it. Uh, my my week was dope. All in all, I say that. I'm with it. What about you, Barry, Sir Barry the King? Uh. It was pretty pretty eventful week, you know what I'm saying? Gotta just, you know, praise to the most I ju Rastafari, I oh. understand. Oh yeah, Lessons. bro, you're not Rasta, bro. You know what I'm saying? It didn't Lessons even look convincing in his I. face. Bro, you see that? He was like, no, yeah. he was like, yeah. ja! Ja! Rastafari, you understand? <laughs> but nah, it was it was it was it was it was a pretty cool week, you know what I'm saying? Um Good things happening. Good news. Good vibes. No good arguments lessons. with any young ladies. So I always have. I hey, if you want, I got mad at them in the tuck because I had a different. I had another conversation earlier that oh. that that that'll blow your mind. Blow my mind. Blow my mind. I could I could pull it out. The, the you know what I'm saying. I'm always having a conversation with a young lady, picking their brain about shit. You feel me? And when you say young, in their twenties. Okay. I just How young? In their twenties, because I'm in my twenties. Okay, cool, cool. Just okay, checking. I'm, I'm just asking. Just checking, brother. Yeah. Just checking. Um, we're not trying to get me too, bro. Bro, it. I could, yo, I could. Real talk, I cannot have a conversation with a with a high schooler. Like the way like, they they sat, like they speak about shit that I'd be like, huh? I could never have a conversation with a high schooler. So, that's, uh, that's my week. My week was pretty good. Um, nigga, I don't give a I fuck. I got a peek. Uh, no, I, I got to peek into how my commission check's going to be looking. You get I'm doing terrible, and it's all right. So if I'm start doing good, we should be all right. <laughs> Bro, real? make that money, my nigga. Yeah, Wait, you, you know, get commission? I was like, oh. You get okay, commission? Okay, this, this, this might work. You get commission? 
I didn't even know, fam. <laughs> yeah. I, I thought like, you okay. just, you know, I thought you just. Shout out to my job. Shout yeah, oh, they was lying to you. They, they, they said, oh. Make, make that money plus commission, yeah. cuz. Let's see, man. We out here just trying to make strides and get better and get great. Mm-hmm. Um, Listen, man, just, or you can sell drugs. Or your booty. Okay, well, what, what, what we're not going to do is sell drugs, right? Or your booty. <laughs> or your booty. Well, no, Yo, but if you was that. selling booty, oh. We never heard of, never mind. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Now, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give that a light of day. If <laughs> okay. you were selling booty, will you also sell drugs? <laughs> oh, I, what I thought you was gonna ask is, I thought you was gonna ask if you were selling booty, how much would you sell it for? That's what I thought you was gonna. Ask. No, no, no. You see, you're you're dangerous. He's saying, would you double up the hustles? <laughs> oh no, trust. Oh no, trust see. and believe. In my back. Oh, in the North Face is lit. I got. What you want? Nah, I got a little. Nah, he's like, I got weed, I got crack, and I got crack. <laughs> and I crack, and I got crack. <laughs> what you trying to do? You know what I'm saying? I get you some crack or some crack. <laughs> no, but you got to de- emphasize no. the different crack. I got crack, like I got crack. You know what I'm saying? Nah, it's two I, different I, ones. I, I, I can't fuck with y'all. I can't fuck with y'all. <laughs> no, sir. All right, man. Good. So, uh, Boogie this Sugar. Week. That shit look like it hurt. Like legitimately, I ain't gonna hold you. Like sniffing something up your nose, you like you know. People I thought you were still talking about the other crack. Okay, go ahead. That hurts. Got you. Go ahead. I'm listening. I'm following. You ahead. you know how some people gotta take nasal medicine up their na the nasal cavity, right? Like you yeah. know the 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 the, the nas whatever to clear their for sinuses and shit. I am probably scared as shit. I always grew up thinking that if you snorted anything up your nose, even if it was medicine, you was a crackhead. <laughs> Am I the only one who thought the same way? Like if you uh, had no, I know I, I agree. Oh, okay, so, cool. I was about to say I've never, I've never, you know the um the 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 visine, well visine going your eyes. I know talking about, but the shit for your nose, you never. Know, I, what you said, wait. I've never, I don't flow nays, flow nays. There you go, flow nays. I'm Never. not doing that shit because nope. that that that's some crackhead shit. I'm not. No, doing that's that. no. If I see a nigga take, I'm gonna be like, whoa, <laughs> take this out. You all right? Do we need to call somebody for you? Because no, this no, is not, he's not. He's not all right. <laughs> you, as the American people, if you snort some shit up your nose, I can't. Medicated, medicated or not, you're a crackhead. You're bugging. <laughs> you're bugging. You're bugging. That's some shit. Nah, bro. I will never forget the time, Dane, we was all together. <laughs> I didn't want to bring it up. <laughs> I didn't want to bring it up. I, that's the first thing I thought. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> like, I swear to y'all, God. Y'all know you saw my face. It was the first Yo. thing I thought. I was like, well, was- Yo, this is when I knew <laughs> me and... Yo, I've known Jason for a long time. And even to that point, that moment in time, I knew Jason a long time. But when we saw that... Nah. All right, it no, was right. probably one of the most scariest moments in our lives. So, He's like, so for, "Oh, so for the people, so for the people watching, we was in the studio and uh, had a bunch of band people, and it was a nice rehearsal. And one of my friends, he he did ketamine. You, you snort ketamine, and oh it wasn't it wasn't, wow. but it was hilarious because I knew that he did it, so it wasn't weird for me. But to see him pull out his little thing." And then go, yo. No, but faces? you got nah, no. But you nah. got to do it. You you're not saying the story right. We were talking, and then in the midst of the end of the conversation, all you hear is, <laughs> "What the <laughs> fuck was that?" And then he looks at us, and he said, "It's not what you think. You want to try yeah. some?" No, and nigga, what the offered, fuck? Yeah, then he offered the shit. Yo, the nigga offered his crack, bro. I'm good. <laughs> it wasn't no. crack. No, it's crack. Uh, no, you're you're right. It wasn't crack. It was coke. It was coke. <laughs> it was the cocaina. It wasn't no, no, it was crack. It was, it was coke. It was ketamine. Yeah. I mean, it's still a no. drug. Yo, what's ketamine. so funny? He offered Sir, it to Willa. I'm he, good. He offered it to Willa, right? And the funny part is, your man Willa said no. <laughs> <laughs> no, he did though. He Yo, Willa one. really said no. Said I was in. <laughs> So much tears. I said, yo. Listen, I me personally, I'm not with the shits. It's okay. I mean, yeah. 
Whatever you want to do on your time, knock yourself out. But me, I'm I never did it. It was just, it was just funny though. It was just funny to see y'all face. Yeah, I'm I, I don't ever need to see. No, that. because real talk, as black people, right? When you hear somebody snort some shit, you be like, "Yo, are you okay?" That's the first thing you ask a motherfucker. You be like, "Yo, you good?" Like, are you? Uh, the only, the only, um. Only black people I give a pass on coke is rich black people. Because that is a rich people's drug, you know. I give them a pass. When you get to that certain how, level. How rich? How rich? 100 million, 20 million. You worth 50 million. They you do coke, worth bro. 50 million, it, okay. You know what I'm saying? They do Well, that. no, I, not okay. Like, okay, yeah, do it. No, it's not. It's, no, but I'm saying more. I get what I'm you just mean. More normal. More normal. More normal. I can't you know. do co- I can't do none of them shits. I'm I'm too sickly. Yeah, me neither. I'm not I'm not with you. I I can't. Like I'm, I'm too scared. Like I'm too scared. Like it, that shit like that makes me wonder like I know for a fact I I do one. I'm going into epileptic shock. I'm going to have an asthma one attack. What? One. going to do one. <laughs> one. You're I'm going to do go it in. straight. You just gonna dump your face in. And just... <laughs> you know what I'm right, saying? Right, I'm right. It's over. <laughs> All right, so I got a quick question for y'all, man. Uh oh. I know the answer. It ain't gonna be that crazy, but uh, versus, I do want to talk about it for like three seconds. Oh, let's do it. Um, the only one who watch. But that's why I want to talk about it. So versus came out this week or whatever, and it was Big Daddy Kane against KRS One. Okay. Two of the fathers of hip hop, or yeah. you know, you know. Can I can but, I say something about it? Talk to me. Oh, That's shit. what I wanted to do. Yeah, I know you didn't um, see it, but I'm curious what y'all think about that. Y'all younger well, than me. I, I I didn't see it, right? I didn't see it because of my work schedule, so I fucked around and missed it. But I don't like it. And the reason why I don't like it is because okay. Big Daddy Kane was the personification of a rapper. I mean... He was that guy. He's like the cool nigga who get the girls. I spit bars. Like, that's Big Daddy Kane. Like, he's, yo, I I dance a little bit. My bars is nice. My wordplay up the paw. I get all the girls. Ah, ah, whatever the case may be. I'm nice, right? KRS-One is the ultimate performer, the ultimate Bro, his his voice just transcended everything. It's like you feel my presence whenever I'm around. So I hate this versus. I hate it because I have to pick. <laughs> like, how the fuck do you pick a swag versus a voice? It's true. And and bro, like to me, mind you, I'm not gonna lie. Like I like I saw it, I didn't see it, so I, I don't know how it turned out. But when I heard the lineup, my brain already snapped. Like, yo, this is the Big Daddy Kane is the swag of all the rappers that we want to be like. Yes, he created it in a certain. You know what I mean? Like he <laughs> is. Like, he he is that nigga that we all want to be like, yo, he got the verses and the bars and the lyrics and the cadence and the 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 stage presence and he's just there. That's Big Daddy King, right? Like we can't take that away from him. But KRS one is the performance. He's the 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 fucking stage presence. He's he's mad shit that we would want to be. But we're too cool to be so right, we, bro. And so it's amazing to me how that so happened. Honestly, and 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 what they did, which was really really dope, um, they did exactly that. Um, Big Daddy Kane was swaggy in his way. You know, he's also still an older man. You know, sometimes you be in touch, but not in touch. But you know, it's yeah, swag. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah, like, all right, yeah. we got it. KRS One had on a hoodie. <laughs> the the um, I don't know what y'all call them, but the the uh the even though what you do is wrong hats, uh the Jay Z joint, the, the one I used to wear, the, the Scully with the bib. Oh, the Hovers. Oh, Hov- yeah, he had the yeah, Scully with the, the bib. Hovers. Yeah, he had on his his white Air Force ones, baggy jeans. By the way, baggy yeah. jeans. No, 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 no. But he had on a 
a, a, a Scully with a brim? Yeah, Scully oh, with a brim. That's crazy. Baggy jeans and regular Air Force Ones. And it's like, it's the epitome of hip hop. It's like, this nigga's like, I'm not going to do anything. I'm going to walk in the way I've been my whole life. And spit my shit. And then, nah. Car- I mean, um, and then Big Daddy Kane is like, I'm gonna just be the coolest nigga you ever seen ever. It was, it was actually excellent. It was yeah. excellent. And you're right. And um, and Justin was here with me. And um, you know, and obviously I don't know all these songs. We, you know, we all, we, that's that's old in our era. Like even me, I know y'all call me old and shit. No, no, but, no, 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 you old as a motherfucker. But realistically, we know that's not my era. You know, they was, you know, KRS got songs fresh from '86, like. Fresh from '86, nigga. That, that, okay, but yeah, man, it was it was like the rapper versus the MC, and and it was very cool. It was very cool for me. It was cool, man. They did everything that you would want. They rapped on new school beats. They rapped on old school beats, you know. And then KRS One Jamaican, so I pretty much realized how KRS One. This thing had been doing reggae the whole time. No, uh, uh, I didn't know that. I didn't yeah. realize it. He tricked us. <laughs> like, everything he do is da 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 da. Hey, everything for him is just reggae, reggae, rhythm, rhythm, reggae, reggae, rhythm, rhythm, rhythm. So it was cool, man. And if you get some time, or if you're taking a shit or something, whatever, yo, I think you should watch it. You said taking a shit. Yeah, yeah. Because that, we all sit on our phones. I'm sure. just saying it's cool to see the old heads do it. And then it was cool because I don't know if it was in Madison Square Garden. But it was, it was at the all of the old. I think it was, was at it? the Barclays. I think it was, it was at the Barclays. I think might have been, might have been. But what was really cool, y'all, is to see the old rap fans. I'm not gonna lie, they, you know, when they put the camera on these dudes, 50 years old, rapping every bar, coming in the time, and they just, they know every word. <laughs> I was like, this is incredible, like, cause you get to see hip hip hop age, you know. But you know, at the same time, hip hop is young. Well, yeah, but people feel if you fifty in hip hop, you you wash, you know that. And, and if you a sixty year old rapper, you wash, right? Jay Z's a fifty year old rapper, bro. Right, but he he's he can't wash though. You know, no, no, no. But I'm just saying, there's a few people. But you understand what I'm saying? Like, ain't nobody ever said, "Let me do." Drake ain't never said, "Let me get Melly Mel and do a song." Let me get you. Grandmaster Flash. Nah, that's with fifty cent. That's you know, facts. we that's feel facts. like they're washed, like. So it, it was cool to be like, to see these dudes still do it, still perfection, still got it. Karis had the crowd, though, because he's an MC, bro. But you, you know what's funny? You know what's funny? And I, I'm, I'm gonna, just going to double back on what I said earlier. When I heard the lineup and I heard the matchup, yeah. I was upset. Right? Because now we're talking about a performer Versus the MC, yeah, and it's, it's it's bro, it's unfair. It's 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 forever gonna be unfair because me personally, I put myself in the MC category, right? Right. Dame, you're a performer, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, do you overshadow me? Yes, you do. But you that's what. But that's but that's what made it cool, and that's why I'm. I, I promise no, you. But, but, but wait, wait, let, go let's, ahead, let's go. go. Let's go. Now, nah, Wade cut the camera, so I felt like I had to talk. <laughs> <He> said, <laughs> I was like, "What well, motherfucker? You see how I slid in?" <laughs> when 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 we talking about what makes it cool and what doesn't, yeah, it's it's tough. It's tough. Right. It's real tough because back then and that era. It wasn't about what was cool. It was about what you were saying and what your lyrics was like. But right? it's so Big a, Daddy Kane, bro. Wait, and you know he ain't no slouch. Wait, wait, wait let, let, let me just go. Let me go. Right. Social media made it cool to say what you're saying is cool. But before it was cool, it was just niggas rapping bars. Right. Who had the best lyrics? Who who won over the crowd. the crowd the most? Right, like, that's what hip hop was. The hip hop was behind the DJ. The right. DJ would come and spin the music. The 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 the, the, the lyricist on the microphone would spit whatever it was to the DJ's doing, and that who was the illest of the night. If we're talking about what hip hop 
was and how it originated, right? Of course. Um, this this Big Daddy Kane versus KRS One to me is not a fair battle because Big Daddy Kane isn't what KRS was is. KRS One is the Justin Bieber's, the Justin Timberlakes, the Jay Z's, the Lil Babies, the, like the the. The highest of entertainers that we have, the the like that's that. And I, I know I did a terrible job right now. I was about to say, yo, what? Uh, I I bro, I'm drunk. I don't Yeah, care. I was about to say Delion is working on you, bro. Cool. We've been mm-hmm. doing this for hours, right? So I understand that my my analogies might be off, but what I'm saying is KRS one is the entertainer's entertainer, right? right. So what entertainer do you hold to the higher standards? We got Michael Jackson. We got Prince. We got Beyonce. We got like who? Who else is the highest entertainer? Put Karis one in there. You can, yeah. uh, but the only thing is, once again, Kane ain't no slouch, and we know that because Kane will give you, like you say, the performance, the oh, show. Course, he, course, he, course. But he gonna dance. He but, gonna but, give you the. But dang, what what I'm trying to say is, and dude, his bars was. You're you're saying my point for me. What I'm saying is, Kane helped create the, your boy. The re the reason. No Kane, no ho. No, I, you're right. And the reason why, and because of that, I won't argue anything because I refuse to have a battle between KRS One and Big Daddy Kane. I feel like that. I feel like that was disrespectful towards hip hop. No, no, no. In fact, what it really was for real, for real, it was actually a celebration. And to be I, honest, I, I hear you. I well, let me let me just say one more thing, and then we could talk about something else. But 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 honestly, what what it was, Big Daddy Kane got the sword to the heights. We know that he had the big hits. He yes. dated Madonna. Yes. You know what I'm saying? He went multi platinum. He did all of that. Yes. KRS One took the under. He was one of the first rappers to get there, and then do the Dave Chappelle and run from it. So I don't want the industry. Fuck the industry. Yeah. yeah. And he's had such an underground following, but it's to the point where, in real life, no one knows who he is anymore. But if, you know, it's like real recognized real. It's like, you know, if you know. Yeah. So it was really cool to see him kind of take his mantle. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was cool to see KRS-One. Big Daddy Kane's like, I'm cool. I made money. I wrote for all these niggas. Like, KRS wrote for everybody. So, I mean, I'm not care. Uh, Big Daddy Kane. So he's like, I'm good. My money up. I've been straight. I don't care. This is fun for me. But KRS-One, for him to command the crowd in 2021. I forgot what year it was. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> it was his moment and it was to the point where in the end Kane just let KRS go bro go because we know who you are the respect is real and he even said it on stage when it was over he looked at Swiss and was like Swiss what I tell you like you got we gotta let our legends live and it was cool it was really cool to just see old school MCing. a lot of that shit did look, look a little dated cause you know we just young you know we're younger than yeah, them you know yeah, so they gonna do some yeah. shit that we like okay um, but they brought out some really cool get I, I don't know, man. I like the the I wasn't happy for me, but I was happy for like my older cousins and you know, my big brother, you know, like you know, like them niggas they was all shitting on they so. <laughs> like, nah, I, I get it. It was a good I, versus, man. I don't want to drag it longer than it need to be, but it was I, I, it was I pretty get good. It. I get it. I get it. So yeah, man. My bad. Hey, where Barry at? I'm right here, baby. Barry asleep. <laughs> Right here, baby. You start talking about the hip hop, the, the old, the old school. This nigga, like, all right, I'm a. No, I'm, him, I'm with, I'm with old school, but I didn't watch it, and I didn't want to give an opinion on something I ain't watched. So, I got you. Are you gonna watch it or probably not? No, I'm probably not gonna watch it. If you're <laughs> not gonna, I mean, it's cool. <laughs> I get it. I mean, it's it's probably right. one of the lowest viewed one. You know what I'm saying? saying? It's, it's just not my it's but, not my style. But it's just that we don't me. we don't respect our elders in hip hop. No, man. I'm not. I don't. Oh, you I don't, can't say that. You can't say that. I don't give. I'm not. I don't. I give them a reference, but it's just not Y'all my speed. About... It's just not my speed, bro. Yo, it's okay to say something is not just speed, dog. You know what I'm saying? That's just not my era of my time of hip hop that I would like to listen to. I've listened I'm... to it. It's just not something that I can connect with. I respect I it. 
I, I just, you yeah. know, um, I'm a, mm. I'm a, I'm a b boy. You know, I'm a backpacking ass, rapping ass nigga. That doesn't so, mean that you have to like it. Because no, 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 no. So, so, so for me, that. I just respect my elders, and I, you know, the same way I would I watch too. some young niggas do it, I would watch. It, but that, that's just me. It, you know, I, re- I, res- I, res- yeah. I respect. So, the but ladies. I get it. I, All right, cool. I, I give them their reverence. I Let's move the fuck them. on, my friends. Um, but yeah, man. I did want to get at a little conversation though, because it did happen, and it, you know. I get no, it. It's valid. It's valid. Mm-mm-mm. Oh, bad. I gotta. I, I no. got mediator, moderator, I roll got... call, roll call, select. Look at that, Delion. Look at that, Delion. Working, nigga. You all right? Yeah, you all right? I just, <laughs> just, just, that Delion done worked on him, boy. Look at him. I, I would. Hey, everybody in YouTube the... world, look at Jay. Jay's drunk. Yep, I want to go to the. <laughs> I want to go to the bouncy house, mommy. I want to go. <laughs> come, 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 come. Br- bring, what bring are we doing? Some... You got <laughs> bring some. This nigga is lit, 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 lit. lit. Yo, what are we lit. talking about, bro? You, you, you with the good vibes behind your neck? It's like always, up? always, 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 and forever, kid. You said always you had something. No, uh, uh, what was the next? Uh, what you have? Oh, I got you right now. Yeah. Shout out to this young lady. But um, this conversation, she asked a question. Her and I were having a discussion, and she said, "Um, do men really want independent women now, or do they do they truly want a woman that's just gonna cater to them?" Were you gonna play that or no? I'm just curious. Uh, uh cause she was mostly cursing, saying the b word and dick. I, you know what I really liked about it? I I haven't been in New York now for uh, you know. You two, missed three the months. New York dialect. That's what you about to tell me. It was so hard though. Like she said that shit so hard. I was listening like, yo, where's she from? <laughs> no, I <laughs> know. We, we we got the audio right. You oh, this nigga was sleep. <laughs> no no, I, play it, play it, play it. Yo play Dave, it. it's a good question. Yo play Dave, the audio, Dave, bro. yo Fuck Dave, you, bro. play the audio. <laughs> But the way she sound when she's saying, all she right, sounds I'm so about to rough. play. It. I'm about to play. It. Hold play on. the audio. She sound like she in the gotta Bronx. Y'all got to stop talking for me to play it. Y'all got to stop talking. No, she not. She not. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, how fucking dare you? So that right there, that that just had me thinking. Like, yo, do men want independent women, or do they just do they just want a bitch to cater to them? You feel me? Like, if a man come home after a long day, is he going to be upset that his bitch is not there to comfort him and to have dinner on the table for him? While, meanwhile, she's she hasn't even got off of work yet. Like, she's still, she's still working. She's still doing the things that she needs to do. That's such a great clip. Hmm. That's all New York. Like, that's so normal to y'all. With the, with the noise in the here, back, I, with the noise in the background, it's perfect. It's like, yeah, yes, that like I want that clip. I want to play that for women down here. Like, this is how they talk to us, ladies. <laughs> so, so talk nice to me. Dave sound like a little kid. So I want you to talk nice to me. This is this is how they sound. Okay, they be like, yo, New York women are hard. I'm like, yes, they are. And this is listen. This wait, is- wait, 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 wait. Can 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 someone reiterate? For our listeners, sorry. Um, she pretty much asks, "Do men want independent women, or do they want a woman to just cater to their needs and wants?" Mm. <laughs> do you want an independent woman, or do you want a pushover? I don't think it's a pushover. Catering to your, your she needs. used the word. Well, 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 well Bobby, she, um, she didn't use the word know. pushover. She didn't use the word pushover. Real quick, real quick. She, I, I, she, wait, 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 no, no, but she she used the word out of context. That's it. Your interpretation. Everybody has. Oh, this nigga. Interpretation. 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 Yes. Wow, that's a new one. All that's right. not the word. Interpretation is not a word. Interpretation. Let Let me know. If it's not a word, then I shut up. But it. We gonna do it. <laughs> Interpretation, bro. Oh well, yeah. Sound good. <laughs> Yo, this nigga here, boy. Should sound good. That's the word, motherfucker. That, that's a, that's how you pronounce it. That's how you say it. This nigga said interpretation. Gotcha. 
interpretation. Yes, she I wish we had the tech. I wish we had the technology to get all the episodes with Jay's drunk and just stream them like back to back. Like intermission and it, 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 it would be it, hilarious. It, yes, I wish would. we could do that. Um, I'm gonna funny. say this. I'm gonna say this. Uh-oh. We have the we have the technology to say. Fuck y'all. Uh, fuck us now. All and right. he and he said that every time we've called him drunk on every episode too. So. That's true. Because we are oh, doing man. our interpret our interpretations. Right. Interpretations. <laughs> but yeah, interpretations. she did not say did she did she did not say a pushover. She, that she did not say. She said catered okay. to your needs is a difference. It is a major okay. difference. Pushover is different from catering to. But that's what I don't want. I don't want. I don't want it to get lost in the words. The right. thing is, do you want a strong, independent woman that's about her shit and doing her shit? Or do you want the type of woman that's gonna cater to you? Period. Yes. That's what she's saying. Let's 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 leave it at that. Let's not add no extra sauce to that right now. Yeah. What do you think? Let's start with Jake before he fall out the chair. Yeah. Yo, Willa. What you think? What's the question? I love this, by the way. This is hilarious. <laughs> I I need y'all to know. Like, I love this. Yeah. <laughs> like, what do you what do men rather not you because he wake up tomorrow we, and he hates these shows and it'd be hilarious what Go do ahead. men not you what do men rather a woman that's strong and independent or a woman that's going to cater to him to them let me say them sorry um, men not you per- men 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 whoa no no fuck that I'm gonna say me for, I don't wanna speak for men you me, I, I'm gonna speak for me personally yeah um I, I I definitely want a woman that's strong and independent. I, I, I want a woman that can speak her mind. I want a woman that can say what she likes, what she doesn't like, what makes her tick, um, what makes her go, what, what, what turns her off. I, I like a woman like that because it takes the guessing game away. Like, I don't want to, bro, I don't know what the, f- bro, I don't fucking know. We don't yeah, yeah. know. D- Bari, you don't know. Dane, oh, but you don't I wasn't, know. I wasn't gonna... Wayne, you don't know. Any of our friends who think they know, we don't know. We don't know <laughs> what the fuck you like and how you like it. We don't right. know. Yo, this nigga. <laughs> no. no, 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 but I get it. But I get it because it's frustrating. It's, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. But I get it because it's frustrating trying to figure it out. Seriously, it, but, it really is. It, it is, really, it, my nigga, it, yeah. I, I, bro. I don't fucking know. So if you say something, and 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 that thing lets me know what what you like and what you don't like. If any, whatever it is, if it leads right. me to the answer, I fuck with that because I don't um, know. I, so okay. you would rather have that versus a woman that just want to cater to you, cook for you, clean for you? Yes, yes. Okay. We, because you end up, you end up with the um the fucking, uh, what's the shit with with with, with Eddie Murphy? Uh, oh yeah, whatever you'd like. And she's I do. barking. Yeah, she's yeah, barking yeah. On one yeah. foot, it's like I, I don't want that. Right. I, I, I want, do, bro. I, I aspire, I need for my lady, my woman, to know what she likes, right. know what turns her on know what makes her tick so that I can make that happen for her. Mm. If, if, mm. if you don't know nothing about yourself, if, if your whole being is based on what I like, then you lost. Shorty, it's like you, that's, that's bad. That's bad. What about me. you, Barry? Um, for me, all I'm used to is Women who are independent. We live, we live in. I was raised by an independent woman. She's, you know, what I'm saying, uh, in New York City. Put that goddamn belly on down. Sorry. In New York City, is nothing but a woman has no choice but to be independent because it's too damn expensive to live here and mm-hmm. not be independent. Um, mm-hmm. so I don't think I can and not be used to anything. It's weird to. It's it's so crazy. It's weird to have a woman who caters to you as a man, mm. and I feel like that's kind of I feel like that's kind of crazy, even in itself, right? Because welcome for, to the south. You know what I'm saying? So now you get a woman who's willing to do these things for you, and I'm not saying there's anything wrong with it, but it's like, damn, mm-hmm. wait, you 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 did 
what? You made chicken, fish, mashed potatoes, macaroni and cheese with some lettuce, Kool Aid, and beans, got some beans, ice cream. Potatoes, tomatoes. And you, 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 you just washed Sorry. my drawers. Like, what's you what's, name it? You know what I'm saying? So now it's like, damn, what, what? I mean, okay, so yeah, I don't know. It, it, I get, I can see why, man. Some men would like that because you know what? He feels like he he went to work and he worked hard all day. So now what he right. wants to do is just come home and just unwind and not have to worry about anything. So I I, I can understand why some men would be open to that, but it's all a preferential thing, like. If I had to pick, I would pick the independent one, or I guess whatever the woman that works hard. But I will be honest, man. Like that catering stuff pick, is different, I guess. The catering stuff, I, because I work so hard at trying to build my damn self. Sometimes it's cool yeah. to just have somebody that's just there to cater and help and build with you. Like I, you know, they like they they dream of building what you're trying to build, and. They just want to help where they can, like if it if that means just as, me just showing up and just being here or, or cooking you some food. Or, yeah, because because so, yeah. honestly, um, you know, just pff, the last few people I dated, one of them never came to nothing, never been to a show or nothing, never did nothing. Other person I dated was so damn independent of damn self that we were competing literally, like you know, her business versus my business. And that it, that was tough too, because it's like, well, do I show up to your shit or do you show up to my shit? <laughs> what do we do? We we both doing shit. So I, uh, you know, I I would always pick the independent, the the, the, the hardworking independent woman. But Damn, I think you, I think you, I think you stumbled in. I think you stumbled on something with that one just okay. now, right? Where you said she's super independent and you're super independent, and you guys are both yeah. working towards something real big right. and major and serious, right? Mm-hmm. What do you then do in situations like that? Like, yo, she got an event or a show, or whatever. She got an event, right? Whatever she's anything. doing, right? Yeah. You mm-hmm. making music, and now you're in the studio, and you got an album release, or, or you got an opportunity to 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 whatever. That has and she to has me. now. So now, <laughs> how does that how how does that work? You know, what I'm saying two people who are super independent, and being super independent. When you achieve a goal that is monumental for you, how do you show up for your partner when you're supremely independent and you being supremely independent means that you're going to both miss right. things for one another? Right. That has been That's tough. In real life, that That's has tough. been the hardest thing I've ever had to deal with with That's fucking tough. with women who do shit. Legitimately. That's tough. It's because then hard. now you 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 stuck and you it's like you want to say to them oh but you don't care about me and it's like not it's not that I don't care about you but I'm doing shit just like you doing shit so then it's like damn right well, how can I charge you for some shit that I don't want you to charge me for right one hundred percent um that is the That's situation tough, that That's broke tough. up my ex way years ago That's tough. um she had a birthday party that she was so excited for but she wasn't turning no crazy age you know it's like. You about to be 27, you know, all right. <laughs> all right, that's cool. Don't say that. <laughs> shout out. No, but I'm just saying, shout out to that. Um, so I'm not disrespecting life. it, but I'm just telling you how I felt. But at the same mm. time, I was doing skate, I was doing picnics, skate fam picnics, building the culture of skating in Chicago. Mm-hmm. And it happened to be the same weekend. And she was like, you ain't worried about my party. I'm like, you turn it to... No, I'm not worried about your party. I'm trying to invest in a I ain't gonna lie, that sounds kind of crazy, Dave. Word. So I to this day still make money and and have done shit across the world because I'm international demo off of what I built in Chicago. But that was a single birthday party. But one a birthday guy, comes once a she's year. She's still though. alive. But a, she's a gonna birth- have more. But you don't know that it's a birthday. Birthdays are something that's celebratory once a year. You know what I'm saying? So, so that's why I can. That's, that's why I can crazy. come off a little crazy. Here's the part that's crazy. My event was planned before her birthday party. Seriously, sis? It's it's just... I, I hear you. I hear you. I'm not going to sit here and say I don't understand. You know what I'm saying? Because, like I said, you y'all are both... 
you y'all both entrepreneurs, y'all both highly you independent individuals. You know what I'm saying? Willow, you know what I'm saying? Y'all both group. highly independent individuals. Yep. Y'all both working towards a goal and then now the goal comes. You have a moment where the both of y'all have the both y'all goals are achieved and it's so right do, there. So do but, I cancel my picnic with all of the black people in Chicago that skate so my girl can have a birthday party? I can't I can't answer that because I don't know. Would you? I can't hear a word you saying, Willow. He's he's muted. I'm sorry. But I agree with Dame. Like, no, I'm 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 not gonna I can't. No. No, I I, I get it. I can't I, I and get you it. Know about this. No, I get it. It's not like Yo, I just I sprung it on you. Bro. I've been working on this for months. It's, it's, it's tough. All it's of a sudden, you're like, well, that's tough. my birthday weekend, so I want to have a party. No, 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 hey, I party. I, I show up. I, I agree with Dame, bro. There's, there's no so, way. And, I'm, and, all, and all I'm trying to say, and, and I ain't trying to just, you know, tell y'all about my little fuck-ass story. I'm just saying that that's a real-life situation, and, and that that incident sparked the end of a whole relationship. No. And what I'm saying now, in in terms of because we never we, we never recovered from that. So now he thought when, I didn't care, and I was like, I, of course I care, but I'm building a business just like you. She was doing what she was doing, but at the same time, I, I'm weird. It's either my business or your. So when you so, so that's my that's it, my point. When you messing it, with people, tough. that's it's tough. Yeah, it's a, it's, bro, it's a tough. It's no, man. it's no, it's it's really one of them things where I don't even know if communication can really solve fix that. it. Yeah, I don't even. You know Scheduling how most people would have to solve that. Yeah, because I promise you, <laughs> communi- You know how people be like, "Yo, communication. You have to communicate. If you communicate, but certain things is above communication. You know what I'm saying? Scheduling. It's one of them things where, it's, yo, bro, you are both busy. Y'all both pushing a brand. Y'all love each other. Y'all are into each other. Right. But it's like, damn. If I don't show up, I'm gonna look like a dick. But at the same time, I got this shit going on over here that's gonna help me which will in turn help you just like what you're doing will in turn help you which will help me right. it's like no, I, so bro, I, I i get it I it's get like it. so what the fuck do we do and it's like damn you know what i'm saying and that's tough bro that that's extremely extremely hard and most in most situations there's somebody who makes a sacrifice and says you know what fuck it cool i'll just i'll show up to your shit i well, yo whatever it is i'll do it i'll put it on pause that's how it happens majority of the times. Unfor- I don't even want to say unfortunately because you make the decision to do that for yourself. So I don't think it's an unfortunate thing, but that's that's hard, man. Like I Yeah. I pray to never be in a situation like that because that is that is rough. Cause you always want your partner to succeed. Cause I if a, if a somebody I'm dealing with says, yo, I have an opportunity that's going to help me become a better person, a better... Bi- what, cool, what you need for me? You know what I'm saying? What You, you need me... What, right. what we need to do? We need to build a time machine? What we need... Where's the parts at? But then now, if I'm doing Willow Wednesdays, but you need me to help you on this end to do that, it's like, uh, it, shit, what do I do? Right. So, you know, it's it's just one of those things when your girl um was like, which one we pick? I think most most dudes, but then, you know, you got those guys that pick the other stuff. So I can't speak to them. You know, I don't I don't you know, I, I love the cater, but you know, ain't nothing doper than a woman that's growing and building and doing home shit. And yeah, nothing cooler but, than that. To me. But so. feeling but the feeling of like you said, being catered to is like I ain't gonna lie. It's a great feeling. It's a it is a great it's a great feeling because it's like, yo, what do you want? Cool. You want this? Oh, I, I got one. I got one. Would you, you, you're an independent guy doing your own thing. Would you be the cater to guy? What do you mean? Would I cater to a woman? Yeah. Like, would you be the Oprah and Stedman? Would you be the, uh, if, the if let if me the, cater to you? Cause baby, this is your I would day. Be, you know what I mean? But be, like that, but like would, that's your whole attitude. I would be, I would be, I would be doing my own thing for sure. But I, yeah, why not? If we're, yo, I'm, yo, I'm, I'm a firm believer. I've said this a million times. If we're partners mm-hmm. and this is what I need to do to help us work and make it work in the moment, right. I'm, I'm down for it. Because if now, let's say the roles reverse and now instead of me being Stedman, I become Oprah at, in, in a period in time. 
You know I, what I'm saying? I know, but 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 in, 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 I guess in my scenario, you don't become Oprah. You never become Oprah. You're if I never become Oprah, if she's successful like that, I you're my yes. partner. I yeah, bro, I love you. Could you could you fuck with that? Yeah. Why? Because you know what? It it we're partners, bro. As long as you as long as you never diminish your respect for who I am to you. Right. To anybody, I'm cool, bro. I'm not saying I won't be doing my own thing. I'm always going to be trying to do my own thing. But if you need me to cool, play the shadows, play the background and do little, I'm all right with that. Why? Because you're my partner. If it's about you financially making more bread, it's not, bro. Well, you you cool with that? You cool with dating a woman? Let's say a woman, like whatever your salary is, are you cool with dating Um, a woman that doubles that salary? Yeah, I'm cool with that. Because it's not going to change what yeah, I'm going to do. You sure? I don't know. You ain't saying that too convincing. No, I... That wasn't convincing at all. <laughs> no, but I had to... Yo, I've you had saw, to... He was like, he was like, look, he was like yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, no, I had to... Because I had to think about it because <laughs> I had to... I legit had to think about it. Why? Because it's one of the things that I've never... It's never come across my my path. But if it happened that way, yeah, I'd be cool with it. It wouldn't change what I'm doing, no. If right. I still... If I'm still taking you out, I'm still going to pay the bill. If I want to treat you nice and buy you things, I'm still going to buy you the things I want to buy you. You just make more bread oh, than me. All right. Shit. Wait a minute. So you've never dated a woman that made like double your salary before? Double? No, never. But just up there. Jay. Mm-hmm. Sir. Yes. Have you ever dated a woman, dated a woman who made a significantly, significantly amount of money more than you? I have. How did you feel? Did you feel like this could work or you felt like, nah, fuck her. She, she got. Okay. So can we be honest? We we, we could be honest right now. We could be honest in two minutes. Cool. I got a time limit. Okay. Um, me personally, I, I I wasn't mad at it. It was cool with me. Right. uh, If 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 that's what you want. Cool. Sure. Not a problem. Okay. I, I respect it. I liked it, if 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 that's okay to say. You liked that she was spending her money, or no? She yes. just made more money. No, 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 no. I I like the fact that I was taken care of, and <laughs> like, no, 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 that doesn't happen much for us. No, true. Mm-hmm. No, that's a fact. I I, I want to say the name so bad, but I can't, and I don't won't. do it. I, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. But. I thought he, you know what I thought you was gonna say. I thought you was gonna be like, yeah, you know what I'm saying. So shout out to you, mama, because you the great. <laughs> That's what I thought you was gonna do, bro. I swear to God, no, that, no, like, oh, that, that would have actually been really funny. I that shit would have been funny as shit. I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do all that and say all that because. I'm just, but that was a missed opportunity for a good joke. Cool. I can't co-sign that. Um, but. But you and, did and, have a woman that made that, yeah. That's yes, crazy. I, 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 I have. Know. Yes, absolutely. I've been with a young lady who, who was the breadwinner and young made lady. the most, and had her own apartment, her own crib, and like everything. I've, I've been a part of that situation. Yes, she was fire. She lived right down the block from me. Like it was, I lived in in, in, in Crown Heights. New York, Brooklyn, New York. Like it was, it was. It was don't like, get an address. Don't get an address. Don't get an address. I'm not giving an address. <laughs> but no, like to me, it, that shit is fire. Like, all right. I, I, me personally, I like associating myself with a, a like-minded individual who who wants to make money, bro. Like, we're here for that, and that's me personally. If 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 you're a like-minded individual that wants to make money and is striving to make more money, I'm with it. Yeah, bro. I'm, I'm not... You so you making, never had that bar, though? Like, you never yeah. had a chick, like... Double my salary? A signif- no. It could be double, but I'm just saying a significantly amount of money more than yours. You know what? You okay. Yes, 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 yes. You know no, what I'm yes. You, yes, 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 yes. You make yes, $20 I have, an hour. She makes no, 25 are, an hour. No, she, yes. You make 25, yes, she yes, makes 45. Yes, 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 yes. I was, I was, I was, a, you, yes, I have. I'm, I'm lying. Yes, I have. And it didn't bother me because it's like, yo, if I fuck with you for real, and hopefully you fuck with me the same way I fuck with you, 
to me, you make money, the financial thing, at, I'm, I'm not worried about you making more money than me. It's, it's, that's not what it's about because at the end of the day, if, you're, if you respect me at the level of me being your nigga, that's all that matter. A dollar amount, because at any point in time, that dollar amount can change and now I could be making way more bread than you. And I'm saying right. all of this is about clicking a button and applying at the right job. I, okay, because because I want to, uh, you know I'm I saying? just want to blow it. So up. I just want to blow it up real quick, and not just say the opposite to be the opposite. In real life, it bothers the fuck out of me that you make more money, more money than me. Um, I, as, I, wait, 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 wait. As, as the woman, yeah, and okay. and I, and, I, and, I, and I'll tell you why. Not because I haven't dated or I don't care at this point in my life, but I know what I do is great enough to be one of the richest niggas on the planet. Mm-hmm. So. When I did date the women who made more money than me, which y'all know me, I like to get taken out on dates all the time. I'm, I'm, I am literally soliciting myself, ladies, anybody, whoever want to, you want, you want to, I will go with you. <laughs> you pay, I will go. I'm Terrible. here for it. <sighs> Terrible. But <laughs> uh, uh, another argument I used to have with when I dated the girl, with the, uh, a couple girls that made more money than me, I was like, well, yes, you make more more money than me right now. But what I'm creating will murder you on money. What I've built and what I've been building, when it works, and when we get there, you're going to be like, oh, my God, this thing. Yeah, the, the, the bag, will, the fruition is real. So yeah. cool. I'm glad that you make more money than me right now because you could pay for these dates. Nigga, I can't afford this shit right now. But there will be a time. <laughs> and that time will come. What you say, by soon come. Soon, soon come. come, baby. Yeah. Soon come. And yeah, I just know where I'm going to be, you know? So it's like, all right, cool. Soon come, baby, soon come. You worried about dinner? We good. So, uh, you know, but that's just how I feel. But, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching another Willow Wednesdays. Like, yeah. share, subscribe. Yeah. Willow got a video called Water Out on World Star. Great Facts video, by YouTube, the way. Facts. All that Yo, shit. we didn't fucking review your video, fam. Yeah, Bro, we can do, we yo, can do we that. In the, we, y'all can do that next week. No, 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 week. not tonight. Not tonight. Not tonight. Not next week. Next week. Next week. Next week. Next week. Next week. Do it. It just dawned on me. Yeah. Um. So go stream water on all platforms. Uh, Spotify. It's on title, right? I don't want to say title before it's on title. Is it on title? On title. It's on title. It's on title. It's on title. Apple Music. YouTube. iTunes. Apple all music. that. Um. Skate one hundred and seven. Skate one hundred and seven. By demo. Never been a lame-o. Go stream that on all socials, on all platforms. International. You know what I'm saying? Um, Come on now. <laughs> go follow Willow Wednesday's Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Yeah, man. All that good shit. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to pull up to the church meeting. You know what I'm saying? Smack. We have Bible study every Wednesday at 9 p.m. Yeah, man. Smack, yeah, man. Smack, 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 so, smack. so, so you don't want to miss Bible study because it'd it be good. You know what I'm saying? All mm-hmm. right. But yeah, we out of here, y'all. We out of here, man. Man, I just want to thank you so much for tuning into Willow Wednesdays. We love and appreciate facts, the facts, support. Facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button for the YouTube page. Big facts. Yes, yes, yes. And click the bell for notifications. Mm-hmm. And make sure to join that family page, the Willow Wednesday family page on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Peace.